happy people i'm back with another video and today i'm bringing you all another bath and body works haul i'm super excited about this video but first i have to give a quick shout out to my mother um she actually received some bath and body work coupons in the mail and i was a little sad because to be honest with you i've been shopping at bath and body works for a very long time and it, i haven't gotten um any new coupons i feel like since 2018 and so bath and body works what's up like i I need I need my coupons okay but um anywho so my mom she received a couple of Bath and Body Works coupons and um she was generous enough to mail them to me and so I got my coupon and I'm super excited about these items that I got I actually ended up going in store I'm not sure when this video is actually going to go up so it might actually be after the the summer SAS sale but I definitely wanted to make sure I showed you all the items that I picked up so it was two two coupons it was one for a free item and then there was a second one for 20% off and so I did get my free item and then I also um, my whole purchase I got 20% off and then you guys I actually just discovered this um you can actually use those coupons twice so i actually got two free items and so what you got to do is you got to place the order online so so you can go to the store get your items and then also if you get the online code from the back of that coupon you can use it twice and also purchase online and so i actually got two free items and i got two orders that had 20 percent off so i'm super excited about that and it was also during the sas sale so discounts on discounts on discounts y'all and i was trying to use my ibotta account while i was in store but i couldn't quite figure it out um shout out to tina marie because she really put me on to ibotta um and yeah when i got home i was able to sort everything out so next time i go in stores i'll definitely take advantage of those uh earnings as well because i think you get three percent off um when you go through ibotta anywho let me show y'all what i got that was a long intro so i actually picked up two bags worth of items and what i'm gonna do is show you all what i got i picked up a couple of single wick candles i actually have never gotten any single wick candles from bath and body works and so yeah the first one that i picked up here is coconut lime breeze that's what that looks like and unfortunately they don't have the scent notes on the bottom of the candle here so let me just give it a whiff and let you all know how it smells hmm. it smells like a a very fresh coconut um that's really light with just a hint of lime so yeah i'll be excited to burn these i actually got these particularly to burn in my loft area upstairs and so yeah i normally burn smaller candles there so i know this is going to have good throw or at least i hope it will i've never like i said i've never used one before but excited to have this in my collection you guys i did find two more the next one i picked up here is lemon mint leaf and that's what that packaging looks like and again no scent no on it so let me just get a whiff of it here Mmm, this smells really good. It really just smells like a mint leaf. Um, I'm not really picking up on the hunt. I mean, on the lemon at all. But yeah, it just smells like a fresh mint leaf. So this is gonna smell really, really good to burn. So excited to have this in my collection. And the last item I picked up here is Ocean Driftwood. And that's what the packaging looks like. It's super cute. I like the little turtle on there. And let's see. Ooh, okay. Oh, this reminds me of something that I've used before. Hmm. Oh, it was a blue candle that I had from Bath and Body Works. Um, I don't know the name of it, um, but I know that it was like it, it was more so like a manly scent almost. And this is kind of giving me those vibes, but it smells really good. It smells very outdoorsy, open, but manly so yeah excited to have this this is going to be a nice one to burn this one probably be good to burn like during the fall time maybe the next item i picked up oh i was super excited to find this item so i've never actually heard of this before i didn't even know they carried this i guess they came out with some new men's fragrances but it's called capri and that's what the packaging looks like pretty plain pretty simple but you guys you know and i mentioned this on my last videos i was looking for like a nice lemon scent and i actually bought lemon drop martini hoping for that because i originally bought lemon pomegranate cream and it was a nice sweet lemon scent and i've been on the search for one since then i purchased lemon drop martini but really wasn't impressed with it it wasn't really giving me that that sweet lemon scent i was looking for and so this capri 
I think it's it. So the scent notes on here is lemon, coriander, and vetiver. So let me go ahead and give this a whiff. Oh, yeah. This is like a nice, soft, creamy lemon. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Yeah, this was the lemon that I was looking for. And I think this is a nice dupe for lemon pomegranate cream and honestly if i still had any of the body care in that other one i would pair it with this i did get this during the semi-annual sale and it all they had was the shower gels and so um i picked up not one but two of them because yeah i really wanted a nice lemon scent in my collection and honestly i probably should have got more because i have a feeling i'm gonna really enjoy this scent but i didn't want to go overboard like i did with lemon drop martini just in case like it might be a slight letdown because I was slightly let down with Lemon Drop Martini. So we'll see how these perform, but super excited to have these. I can't wait to try these out. The next scent that I have here, I did get two more uh, body, two more shower gels and I got the mini. Um, this is in the scent Rose. Um, the scent notes aren't on here, but I'm pretty sure it's just like a nice rose scent. Yeah. Yeah, it's just a nice rose scent. I know when this scent came out, I wasn't like super impressed with it, um, but I did want to give it a try. And so I just picked up two of these little mini shower gels just so I could try it out and see if I like it. And if I do like it, I can go back and pick up more later. But just wanted to try these out and see if, if they were any good. Um, this the scent is okay to me, but um, yeah, I'll be, I'll be excited to see how it performs. I did pick up a couple of fine fragrance mist. Um, not really sure why because... <laughs> don't need any more but I picked up a few so the first one I picked up was margarita cupcake and that's what this is looking like is it going to focus there we go that's what that's looking like beautiful packaging here I love that it's that kind of frosty look to it I love the little um lemon I mean I'm sorry the oranges on here with the lemons and limes like it just looks really good so let me get a whiff of it let me see no scent notes on this one, sad face, but let me just spray it and get a whiff of it here. It's good. Oh, it reminds me of something. Oh, okay, yeah. This is actually a really sweet scent. Um, I'm not picking up that margarita-ness in it. Oh, maybe the margarita is like that more like that more festive. It's a sweet festive scent is what this smells like. It kind of reminds me, I don't know if you all have ever tried the Britney Spears Fantasy Perfume. It puts me in the mind of that. And actually, I like it. So, yeah, this would actually pair really good with Britney Spears Fantasy. Though. So I'll, I'll probably end up layering it with that. But yeah, I'm actually happy to have this in my collection. I was a little nervous about getting it. I think this was actually the last one they had. And I also realized I really don't have much at all from this particular line or collection from Bath & Body Works. So I wanted to give it a try and see kind of how these, this particular line performs. The next item I got here is Candied Velvet Sorbet. And that's what this is looking like. Uh, and that's what this is looking like cute packaging um I don't know it's a little kitty for me but it's still cute though you know what I mean so yeah um that's how the packaging looks oh this one has the scent notes on it so this is how you can tell an old fragrance versus a new fragrance so the old one doesn't have anything on the back and the new one actually does have the scent notes on it so yeah I'm glad that Bath and Body Works decided to finally put their fragrance notes on the back of the fine fragrance mist and also I think they have them on the travel size too but it just makes more sense especially for us who review their products so we can read the scent notes so you all can kind of know or what to expect from that scent or whatnot. So anywho, scent notes on here is sugared violet petals, vanilla sorbet, and blackberry swirl. So let's see what this smells like. Oh, I love this. Look how beautiful that spray nozzle is. Yeah, I love that. Okay, cool. Ooh, okay. Ooh, I really like this. It's kind of a sweet floral scent. Hmm. Candied Violet Sorbet. I was expecting it to be like super duper sweet with like that because it has the ice cream on it because it has sorbet but it's a nice sweet floral scent. I really like this a lot. It kind of puts me in the mind of an actual perfume like oh it smells really good. Yeah okay. If you all haven't tried this one Candy Velvet Sorbet give that a try. I think I'm gonna like this. Okay. The next thing I have here which I was actually Thrilled to find, hope that it performs like I was expecting it to, but anywho, it is Cotton Candy Clouds. That is what the packaging looks like here. 
Super cute. Love this packaging. It's nice and simple. I like it. And I like this this color of purple, like the shade of purple. That's really, really pretty. So yeah, the scent notes on this is spun sugar, pink berries, and whipped vanilla. So you guys, I bought this scent expecting it to smell like, what was it? Um, marshmallow something. Marshmallow cloud or boardwalk walk marshmallow something along those lines. I forget what it was. Oh beach summer nights I think that's what that was. I don't quite remember It was some something that had cloud in it and I was really wanting to get it again And so I'm gonna go ahead and give it a whiff here and see what it smells like Oh, that's a nice sprayer. That's different. Oh, oh, oh Yeah That smells really really good yeah, that smells nice. I also have a body oil. Um, I forget the name of the scent now. I'll have to see if I can go pull it out. But I've been trying to savor that oil because it smells so good. It's kind of a unique scent. Um, I believe it has like hints of lavender in it. So yeah, this kind of puts me in the mind of that. And I really like that uh, oil a lot. So I'm happy to have this. Yeah, this smells really, really good. I'm happy to have this in my collection. So I actually really enjoyed this in the store so much so to the point that I actually got two of them. So that says a lot because I typically don't get too many fine fragrance mists only because it takes me forever to go through them. So yeah, I am happy that I picked those up. I actually picked up a couple of wallflowers. I've not been using my wallflowers as much lately. I'm not really sure why. Um, I know that I did buy some like, you know, uh, Glade or Glad. I did buy some Glad, um, Glad or Glade? I bought some Glade or Airwick um, air fresheners. And so I've kind of just been using those in the meantime. And then when I have like guests or have people over, that's when I bring out the good stuff. Picked up two of the wallflowers. And the first one is Firecracker Pop. And that's what that one looks like. So the scent notes on this is, it says fruit and happy. Scent notes on this is red cherry, fresh citrus, and juicy berry. Um, I smelled this, I wasn't going to pick this up at first, but I smelled this in the store and it smelled divine. It definitely smells juicy. It smells like a soda on um, the 4th of July. So yeah, was super excited to have this. And then the last uh, wallflower that I picked up is Boardwalk Vanilla Cone. That's what that packaging looks like. And the scent notes on this is marshmallow fluff, vanilla bean, and creamy caramel. Um, so yeah, I, oh yeah, I smelled this too and this smelled really good. So I'll be excited to burn both of these. So this was my free item that I picked up, you guys. I was super excited to have this. So I was looking around trying to find something. My free item was valued up to $14.50. So I was looking around trying to find something that was $14.50 and I literally could not find anything. So I asked the store associate to help out. And at first she really wasn't that helpful. She was just like, yeah, it might be a lotion, it might be a body cream. You'll have to just check. I was like, okay, I've been checking, but I haven't found anything. And so then later she actually came back to me and she was like, hey, you know, I've seen some of these body creams that's within that price range. Have you tried this scent? I've never tried this scent before, but it's yummy. It's delectable. So this is hibiscus is paradise can we get a moment for this packaging though super cute and chic I absolutely love this packaging it is beautiful and the scent notes on this one is pink hibiscus juicy guava and sun-kissed coconut you all this smells so so good oh it just smells like I don't know like it smells like you're out at the beach it smells like you're out at the beach with like this really cute summer, cute pink summer dress on. It's like nice, soft, girly, and just outdoorsy. Yeah, I really like this scent a lot. I'm super excited to go ahead and give this a try. And I actually went ahead and ordered the shower gel in this as well because it smells that good. So yeah, happy to have this. And then the last item I picked up, I actually have never purchased this from Bath & Body Works before, but I have a lot of our hand sanitizers and you know we've been sanitizing our hands quite a lot, so I figured I might as well get something that gives me easy access. So I actually picked up a pocket back holder and you all look how cute this one is. Oh my gosh, can we get an absolute moment? Do you see how beautiful this is? I have been into bling a lot lately. I've just been into stuff that's super sparkly and that has a lot of diamonds on it. And you guys, this is just cute, cute.com. And then I like the little ombre and then I'm really into rose gold and gold. So I absolutely love this. This goes really perfect with my little, I have like a little wristlet wallet 
and then i also have um a backpack that has black and gold trimming to it so yeah super excited to have this you all like i'm gonna go ahead and snap in one of my little pocket bags actually i have one here is a pocket bag that i'm currently using right now this sweet pea you all this is a classic everybody knows this scent is really good anywho i just want to show you all how this works snap it in boom bada wham you're done but how cute is this and then i can just pop my lid open and sanitize like i love this so much i just can't that is everything i picked up in this haul um i do i did also pick these up i just wanted to have them just in case i decided to gift my items because like i said i do gift these items sometimes if i decide i don't want to use the item i end up just gifting it and so i picked up some of these little cute little gift bags they had I'm, I'm guessing these are for the travel size items and yeah you guys that is everything for this particular haul again thanks again mom i appreciate you sending me those coupons i was able to pick up some cool items i do upload every tuesday thursday and saturday saturdays in particular are my bath and body works videos so if you like what you saw here definitely stick around and join the happy family and let me know what your favorite scent was in this haul you guys because i picked up a lot of goodies as always leave me some love in the comments down below and I will see you in my next video. I hope you have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye!